Hello children, my name is Josh. It's time to start our letters and sounds lesson and learn to read some new words. Let's begin by reading some phonemes you already know. I'll show you the graphemes on the cards and I want you to read them aloud. This first card says E. This digraph says E. Now it's your turn. Are you ready? Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. E or E. I. A. 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 E. E. Now I'm going to mix the cards up. Read the graphemes on the cards aloud. Go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. E. E. A, E, or E, I, A, A. What a super start! Excellent knowledge of your sounds. Now let's move on to read words with graphemes we already know. Here is the first word. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is E. Read each sound as I point, then blend to read the word. B, E, D, bead. You can use beads like this to help you count in maths. What about this word? Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is here. It is E. Read each sound, then blend. L, E, S, T, least. The least is the smallest amount. Here is another word. Can you spot the digraph? That's right, the digraph is the split vowel digraph A. Read each sound, then blend. G, A, M. Game. It's fun to play a game of hide and seek. Do you like to play that game? Hmm, here is another word. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is A. Read each sound, then blend. A say. It is important to say please and thank you. Wow, what about this word? Can you spot the digraphs? Yes, there are three. The digraphs are sh, 
R and ng. Read each sound, then blend. This is a longer word, so let's chunk it up. Ch, ah, m, charm, i, ng, ing. Charming. If you are a charming person, you are extremely nice and polite. Here is the final word. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is s. Read each sound, then blend. B, l, o, s, o, m. Blossom, but we say blossom. A blossom is a flower we usually see on trees. It can be a beautiful pink colour, just like this. Excellent reading. Well done, everyone. Now it's time for me to mix the words up. Can you read the words on the cards without sounding out? Off you go. Let's check. Read them with me. Say. Blossom. Least. Bead. Charming. Game. Excellent reading! You have started the lesson so well. Today we are learning a new grapheme for the phoneme I. Copy me. I. 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 Well done. Now let's sound talk some words with the phoneme I. Copy me. Say the sounds, then see if you can blend the sounds to say the word. L I. L I. Your turn. L I. Lie. It was not the truth, but a lie. It is always very important to tell the truth. Copy me again. Say the sounds, then blend the sounds to say the word. T, I. T, I. Your turn. T, I. Tie. You can tie a ribbon or your laces, or you can wear a tie to look smart, just like this. This is one of my favourite ties. It's a lovely purple colour. Let's sound talk our final word. Copy me. Say the sounds, then blend the sounds to say the word. K, r, i, d. R I D. Your turn. K R I D. Cried. The little boy cried because he was unhappy. I hope he has cheered up now. We know the sound I is written like this. Today we are learning that I can also look like this. Let's read the new grapheme for I. Say the sound I each time I show you this digraph. What 
Well done. Great reading of I. Now let's move on to read some words with our new grapheme for the phoneme I. Here is our first I word. Sound talk each grapheme, then blend to read the word aloud. Now let's read the word together. P I Pie Super reading. Here is a very yummy looking pie. Hmm, what about this word? Read each graphene, then blend to read the word aloud. Now let's read the word together. T, I, tie. Did you get it right? Here is our third I word. Can you sound out and blend? Here we go. Now let's read the word together. L, I, lie. Super reading. Well done. What about this word? Sound out and blend. Let's read the word together. S, P, I, D, spied. The little girl spied on a robin in her garden. What about this word? Sound out and blend again. Now let's read it together. T, R, I, D, tried. The children tried to jump up really high. Here is the final I word. Sound it out carefully. Let's read it together. K, R, I, D. Cried. Outstanding reading, everyone. Now I'm going to mix the words up. Can you read these words without sounding any of them out. Are you ready? Let's check. Read them with me. Lie. Tried, spied, pie, tie, cried. Wow, incredible. You are on fire today, children. Now, let's learn to read a tricky word. We are going to learn to read the word eyes. Well, the first bit is tricky. This bit here says I, and then this part at the end says Z. When I read it, I say I, Z, eyes. Now read the word with me. I, Z, eyes. Well done. Now read it yourself. What does it say? Sorry, I can't hear you. Wow, well done, yes. The word is eyes, eyes. Hmm, I think you know how to read this tricky word. Can you remember the tricky bit? That's right, the tricky bit is here at the end. It says l. Can you read the word? Let's read it together. L, I, T, L. Little. Well done. Fantastic. Now let's read a sentence with our new grapheme in it. Can you see the word?
that has our new grapheme I. Yes, this word here has the digraph I. Can you see any other words with digraphs? Yes, this word has the digraph S. This word has the digraph V. And this word has two digraphs, SH and R. Can you see a tricky word we read today? That's right, children. The tricky word is here. It says eyes. Now I want you to read aloud as I point to the words. Remember, sound out any words if you get stuck. Are you ready? Off you go. Fabulous reading. Now let's read the sentence together. I spied the pink blossom with my sharp eyes. Let's read it together one more time. I spied the pink blossom with my sharp eyes. I bet the blossom smells wonderful. Excellent reading, children. Wow! Let's finish by spelling some words. Because if you can read a word, then I'm sure you can have a go at spelling it. You will need paper and something to write with. Let's spell two words with today's grapheme, I. Let's spell lie. Segment the sounds with me. Lie. L-I. Let's count how many sounds there are. Lie. L-I. That's two sounds. Watch me write lie. I need two sounds. I lie L I it has two sounds let's hide the word now you have a go say the word say the sounds Write them down. Okay? Let's check our spelling. Did you get it right? Well done. Lie. L-I. Let's try another one. Let's spell cried. Segment the sounds with me. Cried. K -r -i -d. Let's count how many sounds there are. Cried. K -r -i -d. That's four sounds. Watch me write cried. I need four sounds. I D C 
cried. K, r, i, d. It has four sounds. Okay, I'll hide the word, children. Now I want you to have a go. Say the word. Say the sounds. Write them down. Okay? Are you ready? Let's check our spelling. How did you get on? Does your word match mine? If it doesn't, quickly change it now. Cried. K, r, i, d. Four sounds. Now, let's finish by spelling a tricky word. I know you can read the word eyes, so now I want you to spell it. Segment the sounds with me. Eyes. I, z. Let's count how many sounds there are. Eyes. I, z. That's two sounds. The first bit is tricky. The letters E, Y, and E say I. And then the letter S says Z. Eyes. I, Z. Two sounds. Let's hide the word. Now you have a go. Say the word. Say the sounds. What are the tricky bits? The I sound is written with the letters E, Y, E. And the Z is written with the letter S. Write it down. Okay, let's check our spelling. Did you get it right? Excellent spelling! Well done! The word says eyes. I, z. Great job, children. You have really impressed me today. See you soon for another lesson with letters and sounds.